and special meeting for Friday, May 26, 2023. We'd we'll like to call this meeting to order at 9.30 a.m. Carrie, can we have a roll call, please? Andy Duran. Present. Ann Hill absent. Carrie Steinbach present. Tim Penich. Present. Lauren Hirsch. Present. Amy Connell Donahue. Present. Laura Breakdown absent. Great. Even though we're not all here, we do have a quorum, so we can begin. Would you please stand and join me in the pledge? Pledge allegiance to, to the flag of the United, United States, States of America, America and to, to the republic for which it stands, one, one nation, nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay. Moving on to public comment. Uh, I won't read the preamble since we have nobody in the room. Um, is there anybody remotely that's no, expressed no. interest? Okay. If you're watching at home or you come in the room later, we do have an opportunity for public comment uh, at the end. So I'll move right on to our single action item for this morning, uh, which is approval of resolution to non-renew Director of Educational Technology and Innovation. Um, the law does require that we read this entire resolution, so please bear with me. This is a resolution authorizing the non-renewal of educational support personnel. <clears throat> Whereas, pursuant to section 5 slash 10-23.5 of the Illinois School Code, the Lake Bluff Elementary School District number 65, here and after the district, Board of Education, here and after the board, is authorized to non-renew the employment of educational support personnel in the district for the following school terms. And whereas this board received a recommendation from the administration that Dr. Margaret Ryan's employment not be renewed for the 2023-2024 school term. And whereas the board has considered the administration's recommendation and pursuant to section 5 slash 10-23.5 of the school code has determined Dr. Ryan will not be reemployed by the district for the 2023-2024 school term. Now, therefore, be it resolved by the Lake Bluff Elementary School District Number 65 Board of Education as follows. Section one, the board hereby finds that all the recitals contained above are true and correct, and that the same are hereby incorporated herein by reference. Section two, the board, after due consideration, hereby determines Dr. Ryan shall not be reemployed as an educational support personnel in the role as Director of Educational Technology and Innovation in the district for the 2023-2024 school term and accordingly the employment shall terminate at the close of the present 2022-2023 school term. Section 3. The President and Secretary of this board are hereby authorized and directed to send Dr. Ryan by a certified mail notice of this board's decision not to reemploy Dr. Ryan for the 2023-2024 school year which shall be substantially in the form of Exhibit 1 attached here to along with a copy of this approved resolution at least 30 days before the last workday. Section four, further, the superintendent or her designee is hereby authorized and directed to hand deliver Dr. Ryan notice of this board's decision not to reemploy Dr. Ryan for the 2023-2024 school year, which shall be substantially in the form of exhibit one attached here to, along with a copy of this approved resolution at least 30 days before the last workday. Section five, this resolution shall be in full force and effect immediately upon its adoption and approval, adopted this 26th day of May, 2023, by the following roll call vote. So now that that has been read it's in its entirety, may I have a motion to approve the resolution to non-renew Director of Educational Technology and Innovation for the 2023-2024 school term? So moved. Second. Any questions or discussion before we vote? Okay, and Carrie, can we please up a roll call? Sure, Andy Duran? Yes. Laura Birdstone not here, Ann Hill not here, Amy Connell Donahue? Yes. Carrie Steinbach, yes. Lauren Hirsch? Yes. And Tim Penich? Yes. That motion does carry. So we'll move on to uh, item five, which is public comment. Again, nobody here in the room. Nobody remotely no expressed way. interest? Okay, so with nobody offering public comment this evening, or this morning, we will move right to adjournment. So may I have a motion to adjourn the May 26, 2023 Board of Education special meeting at 9.34 a.m.? So moved. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? <clears throat> we are adjourned. Thank you.